up to level three. All right. And Voltaire, some skill points. He already knows the right magic skill. Um, and he's level three. He should be able to learn some skills now. Um, oh, I got the clip too. My fang's level five, but now he has an open spot where he can equip it. Cannabis, let's get a whole bunch of spots of points available, so let's let him learn some skills. A skill slot, command skills, you can learn all the types of magic. Already got the trajectory skill, I think. Oh, it isn't. Oops, actually, go back to you, and let's learn. Not wind magic, interesting. Um, let's do well, this is air magic. Let's dialogue, but here. Yonara has told me this battle. You have served me well. Hope you, do so. Hope you consider continue to do so. We're going to accompany Leonardo to, to Fidok Castle, a backroom holding. Fidok Castle, in the Dark Nines of Garrison, right there. I want you to forge a treaty of non-interference before the real fighting with Galgastan begins. Not with the bank backroom, mind you, but with the Dark Knights of Lotus. We're going to have them hounding our flank while we are occupied with Galgastan. For grace, it was the backroom who brought on this war. Parents died in Lothlorien swords. Had they not aided the backroom, how much suffering might we have been spared? I know this better than I, Katia. What would have happened if we were to face such a foe in open battle? They would crush us. The backroom people, overfed shrine that they are, are no threat. But, ah, but the Dark Knights, there is a foe to be feared. Which is why we must swear our allegiance to Lotus and ensure they are no foe of ours. So your grace means to bend the knee to Lotus? Very carefully, Vice. I told you we are of one mind on this. I know the devil's bargain we've made with Lotus, but it's only until we can deal with Galgastan and Balbatos. The Dark Knights at bay, the opportunists in the guest Galgastani camp coming for war will fall silent. There's our chance. Once Balbatos is dead and buried, only then do we turn to strike the back room. What does our holy knight make of this? The Zenobian throne, throne has no designs on Valeria, no Lotus they. Surely then, King Tristan would not object to a treaty of non-interference, a gesture of support for our burgeoning state. Ah, but I forget this is no bearing on you, Sir Lancelot. Forgive me. Silence. Well, the sooner you and Leonora live for Pridoc, the better. First of 5,000 Goths should help you see to your needs. I'll not have you depart unprepared. So... Oh, what a tangled web we weave when we plan to deceive. 
So, again, our goal is to go up to here and to forge a treaty with the neighbors, non-interference. Let's equip the party real quick. And we'll probably call it after after this. Um... Okay, so he can learn this one right now. And that's pretty much all he can learn. It's just the basic dead shot spell. Yeah, he can learn the basic level attack spells for each of... ...spell types, except for Spirit Surge. That one, he has to hit level 5 in order to learn. And sell. Copper Oberinth. Range weapons. We don't have the longbow here, so we have to, we have to go to the other town to buy the longbow. There we go. Great bow. Yes, we do have it. Uh, okay, and so now our archers can equip the great bow. However, if you notice, it is a two handed weapon. So we are basically by equipping it, you're we're losing our melee option here. Yeah, melee drops down to basically nothing. Um, and... We have a minor dro de drop to dex and avoidance. I can't, and you also can't equip a shield, so... So, for Canopus, I'm keeping the him equipped as is. Sybil staff for the casters, uh, for the the healers. But um, let's see this. There, it might work. Purposes.
I'll upgrade some more shields to Pelta, or some additional Peltas for some more shields. Archers. Okay, so you do have the fifth skill. Okay. Um. Let's see if we can buy one more. Yeah. That's better. So good to go for there, I guess. All right. Okay. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. I also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider packing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that. 